creator of the Clutter Diet book and online program, and today we're going to talk about five ways to get unstuck and push through your fear of making mistakes. We all have something in our lives that we've never quite done before, don't know how to do, so we're afraid of trying it because we don't want to do it wrong. So because we've never been shown how, we are holding back and we just don't quite know what to do next. In my case, in my life, that was how I used color in my life. I didn't know how to use color. I was wearing all neutral clothing and very sensible shoes, and all my walls were painted beige. And as you can see behind me, I got over that. So these are the five steps that I used to get over that. And then, of course, we're going to talk about organizing, too, because that's why you're here. So step one is to pay attention and ask a lot of questions. So simply building awareness and noticing as much as you can. So in my case, I started saying, hey, look, that person's wearing red. That looks really good on her. I really like those shoes she's wearing. And I just kind of filed that all the way. And you can start paying attention to how your friend schedules her family calendar. Or when you're looking through magazines, you can notice different ways of doing the closet. So just start filing that information away and gathering those pieces and just change your filters of what you're looking at. Step two, you want to study and focus. You want to up the intensity on this. You want to go out and look for information. If you're here on YouTube watching this, you're already doing that. Congratulations. So you can read a book, you can take a class, but get clear on what you want to change and learn and start getting very um, concrete information about that. So step three, you want to start small and experiment. So if you're organizing, you want to start with a cabinet or a drawer or maybe a very simple shelving project before you start trying to design a custom master closet. But do something that will give you some success and give you some confidence to move forward. So for me, I started with my color thing, you know, putting maybe a colorful pillow on my couch before I went and painted all my walls. So do something small like that to push forward. So step four is going to be getting help from a friend. So we have all had those friends that push us out of our comfort zone a little bit. I definitely did that. I had friends take me shopping or friends make suggestions about my house and the colors I could use. And that was really helpful. So with you with organizing, this is really key because your friend has something that you cannot have and will not ever have. And that is objectivity on your own stuff. So you've been looking at this stuff for too long. Your friend can look at it with a fresh set of eyes and say, hey, you're not wearing that or that doesn't look good on you. Maybe you should get that out of your closet. So that objectivity is key to help you bust through and make better decisions. And that person can give you a lot of great ideas too and make it fun. So definitely try that. And step five, this is the best of all, getting help from experts. Now you may think that it's very expensive to get an expert to help you, and it could be, but here's the thing about hiring an expert. It is the ultimate shortcut. An expert can take what they know and customize a solution for you about exactly what you need and how you need to learn it. And for me, with my example with color, I hired an image consultant, and this person made me a color fan to show me exactly what colors look good on me so I can take this into a store and I have the ultimate shortcut. I just match up colors to this color fan and I'm not going to make a mistake buying something that doesn't look right for my coloring. So you can do that and it doesn't even have to be that expensive actually. So think about our online program. We have our message board support in our paid program which costs less than the price of a pizza. You can come in and get unlimited support in our message board area, upload photos, show us what's going on. We will hold your hand as much as you need it and tell you exactly what to do and give you a lot of applause when you get it done. So come check us out at clutterdiet.com slash learn more. See you next time and may you always be happy and grateful for having more than enough. Thank you.